everyone, welcome to my channel, 10 Ways to Wear It. I'm Alicia, and on this channel, I take one fashion item or one fashion trend and show you all 10 different ways to wear it. Now, today's video is all about how to add that wow factor to your outfits. I don't know about you all, but the events that I've been going to are kind of few and far between, so when it's time for me to get dressed and step out, I wanna amp it up and I really want to stand out. And that's what today's video is all about for those few occasions that come up that you just wanna really get dressed because most of us are pretty casual every day just trying to stay safe out there. I got some tips and tricks for you, so let's go ahead and jump into these 10 ideas on how to add the wow factor to your outfits. So let's go ahead and jump right into this video and as I go through these tips I'm gonna be inserting some clips to show you all exactly what I mean to give you live examples of these tips and tricks So that you see how to apply them to your basic outfit So I'm gonna be wearing basic outfits and I'm gonna be applying all these tips and tricks to add the wow factor So the first thing I think is great to add a wow factor is to add a pop of color or two And that's one of the more obvious ones But a pop of color is always gonna add some interest and some fun to your look So if you're wearing a super basic outfit it, add a pop of color that can be with a blazer it can be with something simple like a belt it can be with your shoes it can be with your accessories your bag it's a lot of ways to add a pop of color you're gonna see an outfit pop up right now that's pretty basic it's a white shirt my Levi 501 jeans and some gold heels and I added a purple blazer to the look and you can see the difference from when I added that blazer it really does pop and it makes the outfit come to life so adding a pop of color like I said whether it's an accessory or a piece of clothing always adds a little bit of fun a little more interest to your looks. So first thing you can do to add a wow factor, add a pop of color to your looks. Let's go ahead and move on to the next tip. So the next thing you can do to add a wow factor to a basic outfit or a simple look is to throw in some prints. Now that can be with a belt, your bag, your shoes, or it can be with something bigger like your actual outerwear or a blazer or something like that. In the looks you're gonna see pop up, I took that very simple white shirt and jean outfit and I added some prints to it. I added a zebra printed belt, some leopard print booties, and a leopard bag and as you can see it really does transform the look it makes it look completely different I really like the idea of adding like printed accessories because they sort of add something small but it's something unexpected so when you throw in like a printed belt like a leopard print belt a zebra belt or like a spotted belt it really does add something different and just that small little touch it's not doing too much but it's just enough that people can notice like oh she's looking cute you know doing that to a really basic outfit really does transform it so try adding some print to a basic outfit to add that wow factor, I promise you it's definitely going to amp it up. Let's move on to the next tip. So the next thing you can do to add that wow factor to a basic look is to add something sparkly or something metallic. Now, I mean, you guys already know that is my jam. I love some sequins. I love metallics. I think they're a great way to go when you want to just amp up a look. So that's something that I always do. I'll take a basic outfit and I'll add something sparkly or metallic to it. That can be a blazer. That can be a hat. That can be a turban. That can be a bag that has some sequins on it or some stones on it. I love doing that with basic looks and I'm gonna show you all two examples of this in my basic white shirt and jean outfit. In the first look I styled it up with my silver boots. Those are old boots from Amazon and I'll link something similar for you all and I threw on my sequin blazer from New York and Company and as you can see what a transformation. Now this is one of those going out looks girlfriend like when you are going somewhere okay a birthday party maybe it's your birthday somebody else's going out to a club or something like that not that we're doing that right now because we're not but let's just say you know somebody throws a birthday party at an event space or something like that that's a great look to rock it gives you that contrast with the jeans and white shirt and then you have on that sparkly blazer and some nice shiny boots on the feet now if you're not so much into doing a full-on sequin blazer I have another option for you all you can do a sequin hat or beret that's another great way to go you can also do a turban so in the look you're gonna see next I styled it up with a silver turban sequin turban and it really did add just that look little touch of wow to that very simple outfit. So the next thing you can do you guys, add something sparkly or metallic. And when I say metallics, I mean like a shiny type of material that can be in the form of a blazer, a belt, a bag, shoes, like my silver shoes. You can do some silver or bright colored sandals. Either way, add something sparkly or metallic and it's definitely going to bring that wow factor. Let's go ahead and move on to the next tip. Alrighty, so the next thing you can do to add that wow factor to a simple outfit is to incorporate some color blocking. Adding some nice bright blocks of color 
color to an outfit really does add that wow factor. It's something that's fun, it's bold, and it's usually unexpected. So I love to do that with my outfits. I'll do it in the form of, like I said, belts, blazers, shoes. In the look you're gonna see pop up, I took a basic white shirt, my faux leather Bermuda shorts from ASOS, and I styled them up with some color block pieces. I threw on a pink blazer, that's from Misguided, and I threw on some really nice bright blue boots. Those are from Amazon, and as you can see, just adding those pops of color to that simple black and white outfit really did add a wow factor. Like, it really does make the outfit pop. So definitely try adding some pops of color in the form of color blocking to your looks. I like to do bigger pieces, like a blazer and shoes, or, you know, a nice coat, bright coat on top, and some nice bright boots. I like to do it that way. But if that's not so much your style, you can definitely do it with a smaller bag. You can do it with just some simple bright colored sandals. You can do a headband. I'm gonna show you that type of weight um, later on in the video, but there's a lot of other ways you can go to add that color block or those pops of color. So try incorporating some color blocking into your outfits to add that wow factor. Let's move on to the next tip. Okay, so the next way you can add a wow factor to your outfits is to wear something in an unexpected way. I love to do this. I love to sit and come up with ideas on how to wear things in unexpected ways, in ways that are unique. It's part of my eclectic style. I just love to take something and transform it and do something different with it. And you guys have seen me do that over over the years. I'm gonna insert one video of how I recently started styling up a kimono. I started doing this maybe about two years ago and I love doing this. So it's basically wearing the kimono as a dress and then putting a denim skirt on top of it. You all have seen this look. I've done it with my blue kimono, my pink one, and several other ones. And it's a look that I love to rock and it's unexpected. It's a different way to wear a kimono because most people wear them open or they wear them on top of the skirt with a camisole or something underneath. But I like to wrap it and wear the skirt on top. It's different and it's unexpected and it adds that wow factor. Now I'm gonna take my basic outfit that I've been wearing in this video and also add, show you an unexpected thing to do with that. I'm gonna be taking a crochet dress that I got from H&M. You all have seen this look as well but I'm gonna show it to you again because you know it relates to the idea we're talking about. But I'm gonna take that crochet dress and put it over my white shirt and jean outfit. And as you can see it really does add a special touch to the look. That's an unexpected way to wear a piece like that because that's actually meant to be worn as like a cover up. So put Putting it over an outfit where you can see the entire outfit underneath it really is an unexpected way to wear it. So it adds that wow factor, it's something different, and it really will make you stand out. So if you want to stand out and really make your outfits pop, try wearing something in an unexpected way. Wrap your scarf in a different way, use your scarf as a skirt or something like that, take a wrap skirt, wear it as a dress. There are so many ideas out there and I'm really thinking about bringing you all more videos like this because sometimes I just sit and jot down ways to wear things in unexpected ways. So I definitely could bring y'all a video on that. Let me know if you want me to in the comments. But if you want to stand out and add that wow factor, try wearing something in a unique way. I promise it'll do the job. Let's move on to the next tip. Okay, so the next way to add that wow factor to your outfits is to let your accessories do the talking. Now, I kind of mentioned this slightly in some of the other tips, but if you're not so much into wearing crazy bright or bold blazers, or if you just don't have any in your collection, you can still add nice pops to your looks with your accessories. And I actually love of doing this and personally I think this stands out more than adding like a blazer when you have on some like really popping really cool accessories that stands out it really adds that wow factor in my opinion and it's something that people are gonna ask you about and say where did you get that from that looks so cute I love how you put that together I get that all the time when I exercise this particular tip just adding simple accessories to bring that wow factor to my look so of course I took my basic outfit and added that wow factor for you guys the first thing I did was throw on my green boots those are from Shein. You all saw those in a haul that I did recently. And I added my pink bubble headband. It's like a really large headband to my outfit. And those two things completely transform the look. I have on a black blazer with the look, but you can see those nice little pops from the accessories in that outfit. I also threw on a neon colored belt with it just to add a little bit more of a pop. But as you can see, accessories can do the job. So if you want to add that wow factor to your outfits, let your accessories do the talking, girlfriend. Let's move on to the next tip. Alrighty, so the next tip that I have for you all to add that wow factor to your outfits is to contrast your look with sneakers. Now, if you're on Pinterest, then you see this look all all over the place and I absolutely love it because a lot of us are just not into wearing heels these days. I know for me personally 
2022 is going to be the year of the sneaker for me. I'm going to be wearing them with dresses. I'm going to be wearing them with dressed up outfits. I'm going to be wearing them with suits. So expect that in my videos and in my Instagram content. But I love the idea of contrast. I talk a lot about that. It's a huge part of my style. Pairing masculine items with feminine items or distressed items with really polished items is a great way to add a freshness to your look. And it definitely adds that wow factor. So what to do this basic tip, all you need to do is put your outfit together in a polished way, you know, a nice simple outfit, and then throw in some funky or really cool sneakers. We're seeing people do the colorful Air Force Ones these days with suits and nice dresses. We're seeing people do like color block sneakers with really nice dressed up looks. So that's a great way to add a wow factor to your look. It's something that un that's unexpected and it's comfortable. I mean, it's like a why not? So in the look you're going to see right now, I did this basic thing. I contrasted a very nice sleek black outfit. It's a black turtleneck and a black skirt, both from Zara with my green Nike sneakers. And as you can see, those sneakers completely transform that look. Now, if I had thrown on some knee high, you know, high heel boots, it would keep the look super sexy and chill. But throwing on those sneakers adds that wow factor because it really did do something different with that look. So if you want to transform your looks and add that wow factor, think about throwing on some sneakers and contrasting really polished, nice, neat looks with sneakers. But you want to go funky and cool with your sneakers. So if you're not a sneaker girl, you might want to think about adding just one or two pairs of like really funky sneakers to your wardrobe. They can be those really cool Air Force Ones we're seeing everywhere. They can be a nice pair of New Balance. The New Balance are really, really cool to me. They can be a nice pair of Adidas, but add some sneakers to your wardrobe so that you can contrast your outfits with them and add that wow factor. I promise you, it really stands out. And if you're following me on Pinterest, I'm at 10 Ways to Wear It over there. I save these looks all the time under my street style folders. So check it out, girlfriend, and try it out. Let's move on to the next tip. So the next tip that I have for you all to add that wow factor to your outfits is to finish your looks with bold outerwear. I mean, the outerwear is like the last thing you put on. So if you go bold with it, it's definitely going to add a wow factor. Adding a nice bright patent coat, adding a coat that has a pattern on it or something like that, it's always going to make the look pop. So you can have on the most basic outfit, but if your outerwear is bold in a bold color, a bold pattern, a bold material, it's going to make it pop. Trust me. And I showed you all an example that's going to pop up right now. I styled up a black satin shirt from H&M with my Levi 501. I threw on some pink booties with the look just to add a pop of color because you know we're trying to continue to incorporate all these tips and to finish the look I threw on my hound's tooth coat that is by the brand in the style by Lorna Lux and I love that finish on that outfit I think it really does add a special touch to the look and it really does just bring it to life so that's a great way to go if you want to add a wow factor to your looks try and incorporate a nice bold coat now if you're a basic person who likes to stick with minimal pieces then you may not have a really bright coat. I would say think about adding one. You got all the basics you need in life. Time to add some standout pieces for those times when you want to just really amp up those looks and add that wow factor. Add a bright colored blazer to your wardrobe. Add a nice bright colored coat or a pattern coat. And you can just keep those two pieces for when you want to amp it up a little bit. But I promise you, that will do it. It will definitely add that wow factor to your looks if you finish it with bold outerwear. Let's go ahead and move on to the next tip. So the next tip that I have to add that wow factor to your looks kind of relates to the last one, but try to throw in some texture to your outfit. That can be in the form of faux fur, it can be in the form of a patent type of material, but I think it really does add interest and that wow factor to your look when you throw in some texture. Now I'm gonna keep on that same outfit that I had on for the last look, that black satin shirt from H&M, my Levi 501s, and my booties. I threw on some black booties with this look and I'm going to add some texture to the look by throwing on a fur vest from Free People. And as you can see, that vest instantly transforms that look. It really does add that like, you know, 1970s cool vibe to the look and I really like it. That vest is something that I picked up from the Lulu's website about a year ago, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to find that exact one, but I'll certainly find you a similar one, but look at the transformation. It really does add that wow factor when you incorporate some texture into your look. So try it out girls. It can be in the form of a fur vest, a fur coat. They have those short puffy patent vests going on in the bright greens and pinks. That's another way to go but try it out. You will love it. Let's move on to our last tip on adding a wow factor to your outfit. Okay, you all, so the last tip that I have for you to add a wow factor to your outfits is to wear head-to-toe prints. Now, I know my minimalists out there are like, 
head to toe prints up. <laughs> but look, it's a great way to go when you wanna add that wow factor. It doesn't have to be like mixed prints. It can be one print head to toe. It can be a really bold plaid suit or checkered suit. It can be like, you know, a polka dot top and polka dot skirt or polka dot pants. Girlfriend, you can have a lot of fun with this even if you are a minimalist. And I'm gonna insert a look right now. This is a black and white plaid suit that I recently picked up from New York and Company. As you can see in the insert, I have on the pants, I have on the shirt underneath, and I have on the blazer all in the same prints. I threw them on with my red Nine West pumps to pull out the red in the suit, but I love this look. How bold is this right such a cute look and so fun and really does have that wow factor but as you all know I love mixing prints so I love wearing prints head to toe and mixing in different styles of prints so that's something that I do all of the time so I want to insert some mixed print outfits for you all as well right now these are looks from the past videos but they're looks that I've rocked for you all that feature head to toe prints and something that I love to do so there's two more looks for you all to see featuring head to toe prints. I think that it's, it's a great way to go when you wanna pull off that wow factor in your outfit, either add mixed prints head to toe or you can do all the same print. So that can be a really bold suit and a nice bold colored plaid. That can be a polka dot top and polka dot pants and skirt, or it can be any type of print that you want. But I would say, try it out. Head to toe prints is a great way to add that wow factor to your look. So try it out, y'all. I hope these tips are helpful. Thank you all so much for checking out this video all about how to add the wow factor to your outfits. Like I said in my intro, a lot of us aren't doing that much and you're probably turning down more invites than you're actually accepting yours truly. But when you do accept an invite from people that you trust or keeping it safe, it's like you really wanna do the darn thing. So hopefully these tips and tricks will help you to add that wow factor, whether you're a minimalist who likes to keep it simple or you're a maximalist like me, I'm sure these tips and tricks can be helpful for those types when you want to just switch it up girlfriend switch it up on them and show up like bow here I am not what you expected right there are times when you want to do that so hopefully these tips and tricks will help you to add that wow factor definitely leave me a comment and let me know what you do to add that wow factor are there any special things that you go to any special accessories any special you know tips that you can share with the rest of us where we want to just amp it up and stand out and just really shine thank you all so much for checking out the video everything you saw in this video will be listed in the description if I used any items that are old or no longer available of course I'll find some similar items to link for you all but definitely check that description if you want to try out any of these tips and tricks but I will see you all on the next video make sure you subscribe before you go if you're not subscribing to all my regulars I love y'all see you on the next one Mwah. bye